Sup guys, welcome to what will be the first episode of Before You Ride, a upfront mini review of a trail network I have ridden. This will be a series where I show footage of trail networks I've ridden and tell you about the fun parts and the most important parts of the system and whether or not you should ride there. Today we are talking about Narang National Park. The Narang system is huge, and I mean it's actually huge with a vast amount of trails. According to Trail Forks, it has over 45 trails. Now, I haven't ridden every trail in Narang, but I have ridden quite a few of the good ones. The best parking for Narang is located just next to the cycling track. I think this is the best parking location as it's close to the main trails and there is a water source and toilets here. This network is not shuttleable, but honestly, it would be suited for more e-bike type riders if you want to ride a lot of trails that is. Now, most of the trails are two-way, but I think majority of the people that ride here, including myself, just use the fire roads to get to the top. So the push up. The main fire road is as bad as I remember. <laughs> it's, yeah, yeah. I couldn't imagine you'd want to do that for fun. It's a lot of uphill and steepness. Let's talk a little bit more about the trails. The trails here are mostly blues and the system is very rocky. It's not a tech rocky, it's more of a small rocks everywhere type rocky. <laughs> so you might have a, you know, a higher chance of getting a flat here. However, it's still quite fun. Three Hills, Pete's, Bailey's and Barney's would be my favourite trails out here. Three Hills ends into the Com Games track, which is where you'll find all the awesome jumps. Here is a full run of that section. And then into the jumps, we go. We'll drop here, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Jesus, that was bigger than I remember. <laughs> oh, these are a bit dirty. <laughs> cool. Hey. Bloody wild. This is a and it just cleared. Oh, oh this is. <laughs> that ain't nice. Hell yeah. Just clear that. There's a bunch of green trails out here that I'm yet to ride. I've ridden Goenna and it's actually pretty good. When you get to the lower part of the mountain, the terrain is much more rainforest like and it's actually a really nice ride. There's a few black trails out here, but I've only ridden Taipan and it is quite challenging. There's a few solid sized jumps in it and there's a couple tricky features. I'd suggest doing a solid sight lap before sending this one fully. <laughs> Oh, good. That is I like that. <laughs> so, Narang. I don't mind Narang. It's a good change of riding for most of the flow trails that are now in SEQ, and I'd recommend coming here to check it out. It has all the facilities you need and a vast variety of trails. A hardtail would be fine here, but a trail bike would thrive. But you know, this is all just my opinion and what I've seen here. So if this video has helped you out, help me out by leaving a like. Also let me know in the comments what your opinion of Narang is. This series will be a running series and I'll cover most of the trail networks I've ridden. But anyways, thanks for watching. Cheers, legends. Oh, what the heck? Oh, jump. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, oh. A little flip there. A bit wild. I don't like roots. <laughs> oh, so rough. 